General Hospital spoilers. Emmy winner Steve Burton reveals Jason's secret on Morris Finnard's State of Mind podcast. Hello, everyone. My name is Tara G. Welcome to my channel. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like. General Hospital, GH, spoilers reveal that their characters may be feuding on screen. But in real life, there's nothing but love between Steve Burton, Jason Morgan, and Morris Bittard, Sonny Corinthos. Bittard interviewed Burton in the latest episode of his YouTube series, State of Mind, and their combo was enlightening, refreshing, and entertaining. Here's what to know. General Hospital spoilers. Steve Burton talks about his career. Sunday's episode was part one of a two-part interview, and in it, Burton talked about the early days of his GIA career. Burton's daytime debut was as Harris Michaels on Peacock's State of Our Lives. The actor returned to GIA this year after a return stint on DOL. Burton left GIA rather than comply with ABC's mandatory COVID vaccination policy. He left the show on good terms, unlike his colleague Ingo Raidmasher, who sued the network after he was fired for declining to be vaccinated. He spoilers. Steve Burton plays Jason Morgan. Longtime fans will remember that before Jason became stone cold, he was a promising medical student. Burton shared that it was his on-screen dad, the late Stuart Damon, Alan Quartermain, who influenced the character's 180 turn. Steve said, Stuart Damon was a huge advocate for me. He would always go up to producers and say, hey, give this guy something. He's good. He's got something. He noted that it was Elizabeth Corty, who is now Gia's head writer, and former Gia head writer Bob Guza, who were in charge when you and I, Bennard, were starting to work together a lot off camera as Jason Quartermain. Still, we were breaking down my scripts. Then they made a decision to change my character and have me work with you. General Hospital spoilers. Jason Morgan and Sonny Corinthos are like peas and carrots. Bennard added that he sees their characters, along with Carly Spencer, Laura Wright, as the three amigos. Bennard views Sonny as the Dark Knight and Jason as the White Knight. Maybe he should make that the dingy White Knight or the Fifty Shades of Grey Knight. Jason is no choir boy, and fans would have it no other way. Burton took home his first daytime Emmy in 1998 in the Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Daytime Drama Series category. Since then, he has thrilled audiences with his portrayal of an amnesiac who went from the Quartermain Mansion to being a mob hitman. Jason Morgan is one of the most iconic and beloved daytime characters, and you'll definitely want to check out part two of Burton's interview with Binner for more colorful insights. Be sure to catch up on everything happening with GA right now. Come back here often for General Hospital spoilers, news, and updates. General Hospital spoilers. Shocker Jason and Sam's forbidden kiss ignites old flames. General Hospital spoilers and updates tease brace yourself for some exciting twists in Sam McCall's, Kelly Monaco, and Jason Morgan's Steve Burton story. The sparks have been flying between Jason and Sam ever since his return. But don't be fooled. Beneath all the tension, there's a deep-rooted love that Sam can't deny. General Hospital spoilers. Jason Redux times two. With a wealth of insider information and hints dropped during the show, it's clear that Jason and Carly Spencer, Laura Wright, are strictly friends. The writers don't appear keen on exploring a romantic relationship between Carly and Jason for now, so it looks like Jarley is staying in the friend zone. This could mean that Jason and Sam are more likely to find their way back to each other in the future. In fact, it's possible they're already headed towards a reunion. They may not realize it yet, but their friction could be hiding an undeniable soulmate connection. After all, the last time Jason came back, they ultimately reconciled. Things wound up falling apart eventually, but at first they got back together once Drew Kane, Cameron Matheson, was revealed to be his twin. 
He ate spoilers. Jason Morgan's return has undeniably shaken up Sam McCall. Sam is really feeling the impact of Jason's return, especially because she's worried about Danny Morgan's. Asher Antonizen, safety, fearing he will run to danger like his dad. She's been keeping Jason away to protect their son, but maybe she's also trying to shield herself from old feelings. Resurfacing. Since this poses a threat to her current relationship, she has been involved with Dante Falconeri, Dominic Zampratna, for several years now, and Sam would never want to jeopardize the happiness and safety they found together. The whole reason that Jason and Sam fell apart before is because she got a taste of a stable and safer life with Drew and didn't want to return to danger. General Hospital spoilers. Danger drove Jassam apart, but now it could draw them together. Meanwhile, Sam's continuous protests regarding Jason and the potential risks he brings might indicate something more profound. He embodies a certain thrill that Sam may not experience with Dante by her side. Given their connection through Danny, Sam and Jason will always be intertwined in any storyline involving him. If all the signs of danger lead to Danny finding himself in trouble, it's possible that Jason and Sam will have to join forces to rescue him. It would be wonderful if Jason ultimately isn't to blame for whatever perilous situation lies ahead and become the hero for Danny and, in turn, potentially change Sam's perspective of him. He spoilers, trapped together, sparks reignite. Sam and Jason might find themselves in perilous situations after all. It would add a dramatic twist if the series decided to reunite Jason and Sam, stirring up their past emotions. Perhaps there will be a moment where they share a forbidden kiss, leading Sam to question where her true feelings lie. On the other hand, it could be decided to bring Dante's true love, Lulu Spencer, Amy Ryland, out of her coma, creating all kinds of drama surrounding them and their kids. Rumors suggest that changes are on the horizon for Jason and Sam's enduring love story. So stay tuned for more exciting updates. Be sure to catch up on everything happening with Guy right now. Come back here often for General Hospital spoilers news, and updates. General Hospital spoilers. Will the picture Jason paints keep Dex safe from Sonny's wrath? General Hospital spoilers gush that Jason Morgan, Steve Burton, is confident that he will be able to keep Dex Heller, even Hofer, safe from harm. But this time around, he may be underestimating the man he is dealing with. Sonny Corinthos, Maurice Spinnard. It's unlikely that Jason's promise not to let Sonny kill Dex will give Dex much relief, although it has served to pacify Jocelyn Joss Jax, Eden McCoy, for the time being. Jason assured Joss he wouldn't let anything happen to Dex, but that's going to be a difficult promise to keep when Sonny is behaving so unpredictably. Jason was right in telling Dex that Sonny knows better than to target a cop, but Sonny isn't himself right now, and no one knows why except Ava Jerome, Maura West, and Nicholas Cassidine, Adam Hoos. Will that secret make its way into Jason's hands in time to keep Dex protected? General Hospital spoilers. Consider Joss Jax placated. Joss has been worried that Dex's leap toward law enforcement would spell certain death for him with Sonny. She knows how her former stepfather operates and couldn't believe that Dex would even take such a risk with his life. But she also quickly realized that she wouldn't be able to convince Dex to leave Port Charles or go in another direction with his life. Feeling partly responsible for his decision to go do something overtly good with his life, possibly in an attempt to show her he is a changed man, she felt compelled to pull Jason into the mix in a desperate attempt to prevent Sonny from killing the man she loves. Will her efforts be a waste? E.H. Spoilers? Tease Dex Heller proceeds with caution. Dex may be consciously aware of Sonny's threat to his mere existence, but he's not going to live in fear. He can't hide from the guy for the rest of his life and be happy at the same time. Taking the biggest chance he has yet. 
Getting into the Port Charles Police Academy is going to bring Dex a sense of satisfaction he hasn't felt since he first joined the military. Besides, he knows that any chance he has at scoring another shot with Joss will have to come by way of him earning it and proving to her that he's not the type of guy who kills helpless, fragile old men. But will Dex overestimate his sense of safety with Jason looking out for him? General Hospital Spoilers Jason Morgan doesn't know who he's working against. It wouldn't be Dex's fault if he got the impression that he didn't have to worry about Sonny anymore because Jason was on the case. He can't possibly have ears and eyes on Sonny all the time, and he certainly doesn't have such resources inside of Sonny's organization. If he wants to make a hit on Dex, he will. Jason will have to use more clever means to keep Sonny at bay. His latest effort was to remind Sonny that he would lose Christina Corinthos Davis, Kate Mancy, if he follows through with any plans to kill Dex. But off his medication, Christina may not matter as much to Sonny as she normally does. Will he risk his entire empire going up in flames because of a rat like Dex just to stay in his daughter's good graces? It doesn't sound like it. Dex may need more protection than Jason can offer. Keep checking back for more GH news and spoilers to see how this shakes out. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and stay with us.